I need to know why you busted my door in, where the warrant is. First of all, because you need a, I don't care what kind of call you got outside from anybody walking around outside, you need a warrant to bust my door in. I just had four cops with AR-15s on my front door and busted it down because somebody called them, said a Hispanic male had his AR, had an AK-47 or whatever. And, and that's all, that's all the information you need to bust my door down. Okay. Are you ready for me to answer? No, I'm at, that's the question. Okay. Because I know you need more than, I, 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 I've been, I'm well-versed in this. Okay. Okay, I've done time. I'm well-versed in this. You have no right. I don't care who calls you. I don't care who calls you. You have no right to bust my door down without a warrant. Even if I did have an AK-47 in here, I am fully within my rights to own an AK-47 as long as it's not an automatic, an automatic firing weapon. End of story. I'm a felon. You guys didn't know that when AR-15s were, okay. were drawn at my front door. I can answer. I'm here to talk with you. Come on. Okay. Yes. Under normal circumstances, it does require a warrant. Under exigent circumstances, a warrant is not needed. Exigent circumstances requires what? A full description. Okay. All you guys had was a Hispanic male. You had no clothes on. You had, you had you no know, kind of clothes. And, and exigent circumstance, it requires a full description. Okay. I'm here to discuss with you. I'm not here to get yelling in a yelling match. Yeah, because nobody just because then nobody just draw down on you with AR-15s. So I understand why you're so calm, cool, and collected. And it's just my house. I live here. Y'all just busted my door in and drew AR-15s on me for doing nothing more than washing my fucking dog. I just got out of class. Now look at my front door, and you gonna sit here and tell me to calm down? I, I need names and badge numbers. I don't want to hear nothing else. I need names and badge numbers. That's it. I got nothing else to say to anybody. I need names and fucking badge numbers. From everybody who just busted my fucking door now. Where's my fucking notebook at? We'll get it for you, man. Yeah, bring me my backpack. Oh, there it is. I need names and badge numbers. Right. Oh, they're writing it down for me? Perfect. What was your name? David Reynolds. David, all right. David, just so you understand, I think, from my understanding, the maintenance man's here. Yeah. He can fix the door. Mine's at wall three. I don't care. Yeah. Where's, where's, where's he at? He's here. He was just here a second. so fucking pissed off right now you don't even understand people are dying every day another there's another video on facebook of one of me dying every day and y'all don't give a fuck every day had this have gone any way differently i'd be laying dead in my own apartment for no fucking reason and don't nobody care don't nobody give a fuck yeah, they just, but somebody called him, said they seen a Hispanic male with an AK-47. They came to my door, busted my door down, and put me in handcuffs with no warrant. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah, names and badge numbers. Had this have gone any differently, I'd be dead in my own apartment for doing nothing wrong. Thank you. Now get the fuck out of my apartment. Get the fuck out of my apartment. Yeah, tell him, come on. David, you want to talk to me? Yes. Okay. I'd have been dead had that have gone any, any, any differently. They'd have been dead. And don't none of y'all give a fuck. It's a new video on Facebook every fucking day of y'all killing people. And y'all don't give, I don't give a fuck. Exodus the circumstance requires a full description. All you had was a Hispanic male. You had nothing else. Okay. David, if you have more questions, contact us. I have no more questions except why do y'all keep killing us? David, they're going to take you down, man. Come on in. This is what I got all those ass whoopings for. Halfway.